Oh boy, it's mail day. What is up everybody? I am Mace from the Mockbuster YouTube channel. Today's shirt of the day is my favorite shirt, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre shirt. This is how shirts should be done, dude. Have the OG theatrical poster, put it on a shirt in high res, post it up, and then, you know, just have it like that. You know, I do enjoy some OG uh, poster artwork, and I also do enjoy when, you know, because obviously I'm a creative. I really enjoy when, you know, companies get actual artists to make you know, different artwork and stuff like that. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. But anyways, uh, today, yes, I ordered something. I ordered a Shout Factory uh, 4K from the mail on from Amazon Prime. Got it in a day later. Gotta love that Prime uh, one day free shipping because it's what saves me $7 on shipping. So that's pretty cool. But yes, this is a Shout Factory release that I didn't know. Uh, and I was kind of tempted on whether I wanted to get it or not because I'm pretty shallow. There is no uh, slip cover that comes with this, so spoiler alert. But, um, you know, this is not really being, you know, heard about. No one's really talking about this, I think. Because uh, I'm going to be doing a review for this 4K tomorrow. And at the time of recording, no one has done a review for it. No one has done an unboxing for it. And you think, why? Because it's such, it's such a, um, it's a, it's an Oscar-nominated film. It was, you know very iconic in my circle so i don't know why but here we got the amazon package I already opened it up pulling it out what did i pick up today you ask i pick up i picked up the shout factory release 4k blu-ray of anthony quinn in the message now this is a islamic film uh, if you don't know me i grew up in an islamic household so this is a very near and dear to my heart. You know, my entire family watched this movie literally every single year. <laughs> and this was like one of the first pieces of physical media because uh, they sold these at the Islamic churches, which we call Imam Bargas or mosques or whatever you want to call it. So they sold these with like, you know, videotapes of processions, documentaries and those kind of stuff. But this was like one of like our family's first ever physical media. Because when you first migrate to Canada, what do you got to get? You got to get a computer, you got to get a TV, and you got to get a VCR. And this was like one of the first VHS tapes. In fact, I actually have them. And they're still in pretty good condition. Uh, this is a three-hour movie, by the way. And uh, here is the OG <laughs> VHS tape. This is for part two. Uh, I i don't know if this is bootleg or not. I think this is bootleg. Let me see. I'll pop it open. I have no idea. Super HQ. Can anyone tell me about this? But uh, yeah, uh, this is a very interesting. So when I heard that this was getting a 4K release, I knew I had to pick it up. So yeah, here is the OG vhs tape with a very nice solid shelter this is in my dad's praying area and each tape is 96 minutes but yeah i actually really like this artwork but this is a story i, I guess i can know oh, i know why people don't really talk about this film is because you know it is about religion it is about like islam and you know muslim culture and stuff like that but it is starring anthony quinn uh this is a three disc set so the first one comes with the 4k it's a three hour thing they don't compress anything so the first thing is just the full 4k and then the second disc is a Blu-ray, which comes with the restoration documentary, audio commentary, and producer, director, Mustafa Akkad. So if you guys don't know, Mustafa Akkad is the producer for the Halloween films. So a little trivia there. He sadly was, he, he passed away in a terrorist attack, which is very sad. But he was able to make a lot of really good movies. And a lot of people don't like Mustafa Akkad with the way he was trying to uh, force Michael Myers into the scene when John Carpenter really didn't want to make sequels. He didn't make a sequel. He wrote the second and third one, I believe. But yeah, um, you know, this comes with a bunch of stuff. A restoration documentary, uh, audio commentary uh, in English, uh, making of an epic Muhammad uh, Messenger of God. Uh, promo clips, original theatrical trailer, and a 2018 theatrical re-release trailer. Disc 3 is just basically the same thing, but in Arabic, which is really cool. Because uh, you get the audio commentary from Mustafa Akkad in Arabic, and the original trailers and stuff like that in Arabic. And i never seen the Arabic version. My dad has seen it, and he said he, he thought it was better than the English version, which, oh, very sussy. 
But um, I'm just very excited to get into this. You know, not a lot of people are talking about it. Very underrated 4K. This does have all the bells and whistles, even though this doesn't have, this has a DTS HD Master 5.1, but this does have Dolby Vision. So I am very, very excited to check this out tomorrow. But again, it is a long ass movie. Three hours plus movie. <sighs> but it is a, it is a, um, is a, it's an epic film shot on location, an amazing score. Yeah, it even it was nominated for a best music original score. So that will be fantastic to watch. I love me some Anthony Quinn and uh, yeah, so this is the 4K plus Blu-ray Ultra HD combo pack, 3 disc set. My only gripe is that it doesn't come with a uh slip cover, which I would have thought would be very nice to have. But you know, they they keep the same theme cuz here's the OG uh VHS tape and see how it has like all those things and then the same the same image on the bottom here. So that's cool. Uh, so yeah, that was my pickup of the day. The Message on 4K Blu-ray. They had another Anthony Quinn movie. It was called Somethings of the Lion, Lessons of the Lion, something like that. But these go for 39 bucks a piece, right? A brand new boutique 4K. Costs a bit of money, uh, but I'm excited to get into this. This is an iconic film. Uh, a very near and film near and dear to my heart within my family and all that stuff. And I'm very excited to give some... Um, thoughts on this when i watch it i'm very excited for the 4k transfer because again this was a huge budget film uh you know a lot of on location filming they hired really fantastic actors and you know this has dolby vision so i am very excited to check that out so yeah that was my pickup of the day the message on 4k blu-ray i know a lot of people haven't picked this up and uh you guys should because this is a fantastic movie if you like things like uh spartacus and um specifically if you like the ten commandments this is basically the islamic ten commandments but yeah so the message on 4k blu-ray that was my pickup of the day if you enjoyed uh, this video please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you like physical media content in general i do hunting videos i do pickup videos mail day videos like this i do 4k reviews whenever i can uh, because I feel like the, the, the market is so oversaturated at this point, but yeah, so, and I think I'm, I'm going to be getting into movie reviews once I hit 1000 subscribers. Also, I want to say thank you for 800 subscribers. That is absolutely fantastic. I remember the early days of having 30 subscribers and be like, oh shit, I'm in the big leagues, but I want to say thank you for 800 subscribers. Uh, we, cause we passed, we recently passed one year, our one year anniversary of making videos. My first ever video was picking up Blu-rays at the, um, at the, at the, what's it called? At the Fresh Co, my local grocery store. And, uh, yeah, so it's been a wild ride. Uh, we've gone through some highs, gone through some lows, you know, gone through a bunch of haters, but you know, we got way more supporters and I want to thank you all for that. So yeah, uh, that was it. Um, yeah, so again, if you like physical media, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I do everything, reviews, hunts, blah, blah, blah. You know the spiel. And uh, yeah, so thank you so much for watching the video. I am Mace from the Mock Buster YouTube channel. Please have yourself a good day, night, evening, afternoon, morning. Whenever you're watching this, please stay safe and God bless. So yeah, make sure to stay tuned because I will be uh, doing a 4K review of this film. I also want to mention that this came in a very nice bubble mailer. I don't know why. What's going on? Maybe because I got a boutique Blu-ray that because... Uh, they put more effort into the Blu-ray. It costs more, maybe. I have no idea because this, uh, I got a previous 4K Blu-ray through Amazon and it came in like a shitty like paper bag. So I don't know what's going on with that, but hey, at least we got some quality. So yeah, anyways, thank you so much. Uh, peace out, guys. Along with physical media. Support physical media. Support boutique labels because Lord knows they're the only ones who at this point are putting an effort into actually restoring classic films. So yeah. Boom. See you guys.